Today I'm gonna eat broccoli and marshmallow candy to see exactly what it does to my blood sugar. So a few days ago, I ate a few marshmallow candy like this, and this is the impact it had on my blood sugar. So quite a massive spike. Today I'm going to eat marshmallows again, but this time I will first eat a whole bowl of broccoli like this to see if the fiber in the broccoli will help reduce the glucose spike from the marshmallow. And I'm really curious to see exactly what it will do. Now, if I scan this as one of my very unhealthy meal in my sugar AI calorie tracker, we see that a meal like this is about 373 calories with 60 grams of sugar. Of course, it's not very clear how many marshmallow I'm gonna eat on this picture, but overall, which kind of helps fool the app to think that this is a healthy meal, even though I'm going to eat a whole lot of sugar. So I'm really curious to see on the glucose chart exactly what it will do. All right, it's now been two hours since I ate my marshmallow with my bowl of broccoli. Let's now look at the glucose monitor to see exactly what it did. So the marshmallow alone did one of the biggest spike I've had recently, 140, 130, something like this, which is a really big spike. And today, after eating a bowl of broccoli and the marshmallow, we see that the spike is a lot lower. So adding fiber in the meal is always a very good idea to reduce a little bit the glucose spike of different foods. Let me know in the comments what you guys want me to test next time and see you very soon.